Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Maria Stanica and I am a sophomore in high school. I'm pretty sure that is the 50th time I've said that because I am so awkward I can't even say two sentences. So this YouTube channel is a product of brainstorming for an English project um, this year. We were... Why did I just clap my hands? I don't know. We were getting... We... We were asked to come up with an idea for a project. Uh, we had we had almost no restrictions for it, except for that it needed to target a specific audience, and there had to be some sort of need for it. It didn't have to be a huge need like feeding starving children in Africa, which is a need, definitely. But we were allowed to target a smaller audience or work toward it for a smaller need, if that makes any sense. And I've been doing book reviews um, on a blog for a long time now, and I love books. I am absolutely, as you can see from the shelves behind me, there's actually one more shelf up there, and they're stacked two books deep. So, I love books. I've always loved books. I've been grown up with books. And I think that it's really important for people to discuss books, because I know that when I was younger, I would just read books to read them, and then I'd forget about them after I finished. And it wasn't until I actually found YouTube book reviews that I realized that, you know, you can look at them a little bit deeper. Not every book you're going to read, you're going to like, and you'll see why. You don't just read and then forget. You read and you think and you remember. Not necessarily details, but you know, you remember the plot and you remember what you liked and you kind of learn what style you like, what categories, what genres, things like that. I'm really excited to kind of get started. Um, it's going to be a great project. Uh, who knows, maybe I'll continue doing it after the project is actually over, after my sophomore year is over. But uh, for now, I'm really excited. It'll get me uh, to make more time to read because anybody who is in high school knows, is, especially if you are in a college prep high school like I am, you don't have a lot of time to read and you have to make time. Because of this project, I'll be more motivated and I'll be able to make time to read because that's going to be my homework. So in a way, it's I'm trying to help the community, the reading community, and I'm trying to help myself too. I think it's going to be kind of a self-growth thing. The types of videos that I'll be doing are book reviews, book hauls, um, book discussions, like genre discussions, anything pretty much relating to books, book tags. Maybe. I'll also try to do a document my life at the end of every month, which is basically video clips from your entire month put together just to see what you did the month and you can look back and remember and just say, wow, I remember that. That was so cool. I had so much fun doing that. So I am really excited. I keep looking down. I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm a strange person. Anyways, I'll also try to be ending uh, my videos with a random fact. Just so you can get to know me. Um, you'll probably be learning random facts throughout my videos anyways because I tend to ramble. By the way, I apologize in advance for camera quality and bad lighting. I don't think I'm going to invest at this point in time in good lighting. I am a sophomore in high school. The most money I get is allowance from my parents for doing chores around the house. And I don't have, and I want to spend that on books, you guys, sorry. Um, maybe I'll save up for lighting if this goes places, but right now, you might have to deal with some shadows all up in my face or like one light on my nose it makes it look so shiny or I'm, so, I'm sorry. And camera quality wise, I do have uh, a pretty good camera, but it takes a little while to set up, so I'm going to start playing with that a little bit more, learn how to work with the camera a little bit better, see what distance is good, uh, placement, lighting, all that types of stuff. So for now, you get my lovely camera on my Mac. Because, oh my gosh, I just moved it. For the moment, you'll get the lovely camera on my Mac because I can see myself in it, so I know if I'm too far away, or if I'm doing something weird, or if something's going wrong. So for now, this is what we're gonna go with. I hope that doesn't bother you. Uh, there were definitely, hopefully I'll make some blooper videos because there are so many bloopers in this video already, and I just know if I continue to film, there's just gonna be more and more and more of them. So 
tell me if you guys want that. I think I went over everything I wanted to go over. Thank you for tuning in. I'm super excited for the project. And actually, I love book recommendations. I will seriously make a Word document with all your book recommendations in it. Uh, just give me book recommendations, um, movie recommendations, anything, because I love movies and books. So... Uh, thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned for more videos. Uh, click the subscribe button. If you like me, if you wanna... I don't know. Join me in more book discussions. Thumbs up if this reminds you of Cash Day Tuck's outro, old outro. Thumbs down if you don't. Why? Just why? Random fact for this video, I wear glasses. Yeah, I know. Look. Whoa. Yes, they look like hipster glasses, which I didn't know what hipster glasses were until I got these. And then everyone said, oh my gosh, you want hipster. And I tried to explain to people that the lady put them on my face and I liked the way they looked, so I bought them. But nobody believed me. They thought I was going hipster. That's my random fact for y'all.